Mushy Mushy Peeps, it's Chris Villano. Welcome back to the channel. Today is episode three, the finale of the Two Hype Microwave Cook-Off. The first two episodes were quite amazing. We have the final contestants. First up, Moochie. Oh yes, this guy, I don't know how he made it here, but he is here. Now the next up, this guy is known to be probably the best chef in Two Hype, debatably. We got Jidel. Oh yes. Goody. Back with the microwave. Mitchell, we got this. I have your prize here. We just get it right now? One of you, maybe both of you, will be getting this golden microwave trophy. That is beautiful. I can't tell if it's like golden or it's just covered in a lot of dust. It it's work. golden. Does it work still? It does. Wow. You can actually okay. use this as well, but it is the finale, so I have one twist for you. You're not actually going against each other. Oh, what? You're going to be teaming up. Thank you. God. And I've brought the best chefs that I believe all the way from the south. Special guests, Cash Nasty and Malcolm. Good. Oh yeah, man, I this know. duo here is, I think they're undefeated in everything they do together. And uh, <laughs> contestants, you have 20 minutes to concoct the best meal. The timer starts now. How this works is, is I'm gonna keep a tally of every time there's a use of the microwave. If I don't like what I see, I deduct. It's just gonna come down to how it looks, how it tastes, and how many times they use the microwave. Why don't you just microwave random shit? That's what I did. That's, uh, that's the only reason why I won. So basically what we're gonna do right here, we're gonna, we're gonna make some tortillas, right? We're gonna keep it real simple and basic, cause man, it's a fucking microwave. What else you gonna do? Simple, basic, right? <laughs> All right, early predictions. I think Malcolm and Cash, they're not fans of the microwave. They actually cook. James as well. The only person that I think is probably has the best chance of a microwave high score is Mitchell. Microwave on high for three to four minutes. Oh, looks like both teams are starting the use. Real simple, real basic. All right, man, we need some butter. What? What? That's three of them. Let me see. Ooh. Chris ain't got this. Like the way you think about it, eh? Should we do these now? How long are these, though? These are three minutes. Yeah, let's just do these. Because we have to take these apart, too. Yeah. All right, I'm going to start figuring out this dessert. Just uh, get some rough drafts going. Oh, I think the power just shut off. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I don't know if we can use three at a time. We might have shorted Jesse's electricity. That's the second time we've done that this month. I paused the timer. So Chris about to be late. I'm going to make it like a little animal. <laughs> Creativity, mm -hmm. right there. One up the butt, maybe. Nice. Oh. All right, I'm moving the microwave. Oh man, damn it, look down right here, man. Woo! All right, so we got a microwave there, here, and there now. Yo, yeah. no. blessed and disgusting. All right, the Twinkies. Put the thing in Twinkies. Oh, hey, 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 we did a video of Bustle Disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, that was one of the things. Like, and it was Bustle. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, I need that more space. I'm going to take a lap. Chris could be in a good mood, man. I'm telling you, man. We're going to make oh, Chris feel good. He's going to feel good. Oh, you will. Oh, I just saw a microwave use. What's going on over here? Okay. Oh, man, you nice right, Chris. Let's believe that, man. Oh, we're getting really right. Okay, okay, I like it. How's the creativity coming over here, James? I feel like me and Mitchell are being very creative. Oh, I like my buns buttered. I do like that. All right. Get a waft of that. <sighs> man. So with these, with these being two, yeah, like, that, 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 one, do that last. You know what I mean? That, and that just dessert, right? I love that idea, bro. Man, I love that. Came in, huh? I love that idea, bro. Oh my god, come with me, come with me. They almost got double points. But James said, no, let's only use one microwave. I've been waiting to see who's gonna use two at the same time. I'm gonna go ask Cash and Malcolm if they've used two at the same time. Fellas, fellas, fellas. Yeah, yeah, what's up? Talk to me. How much have you been using the microwave today? Uh, maybe, well, you well, get the fuck out of way. You'll see that you okay. been utilized right now. Get oh, you got two uh, cups. Yeah, 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 we got two, two cups. cups. Have you ever thought of splitting it? Maybe using two at the same time? What do you mean, Mike? Two. There's three microwaves oh, now. No, no, that's your question. No, 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 no,
Except They're gonna keep turning off if we if we keep using the third one. What kind of fucking electricity is this? this is a three million dollar home? Can't fucking do three microwaves? I guess no one's gonna get that extra point. Well, what we tried though. We had a we had a low belt microwave here. Right? I didn't see it. I have to see it. Well, you didn't see it. You, you commented <laughs> on it earlier. I didn't see it. <laughs> what is that? You started it? Yeah. It has twelve minutes on it. It's twelve o'clock, Mitchell. That's the time. You, there's nothing going on. What? Is this double action? Double action. Wow. I'm a man of my word. Double microwaves equals double points. <clears throat> yeah, we just got done cooking the rice over here by Kuwait. Now okay. we're using the- Oh, I like yes. chicken nuggets. Yes. Yes. yes, Are those hush yes. puppies? Chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets, even yeah. better. Oh, I love the sound of that beep. I do not like early pullouts. We don't pull out over here. Cash and Malcomucci and James are killing it right now. I'm not killing gonna lie. it. They are killing bro, it. Bro, they're using the exact same shit as you open the package, bro. Man, I'm, I'm about, trying bro? to tell like, you, this is a microwave challenge, fellas. Get up on that set right quick, Wait, bro. We got so this, bro. All right, I took my lap. I'm coming back. Contestants, 11 minutes. All right, so after my lap, it looks like Mitchell and James are using great use of the microwave, but I'm not really sold on what they're cooking. I don't even actually know what's going on. Huh? Things you put in the oh, the meat, with the rice, with the cheese, and then we're going to roll it up. Wait, 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 wait. Toast? I kind of want some of it. I ain't gonna lie. I know how to want some of that. And especially with the butter. Cut them in threes. Go. Yep. That one. Got the fucking one. That's the fucking one, man. I know. That's the fucking one. How you do that right there? You just did. Come on now. Yeah. They're hype. Some men say they're. <laughs> oh brother, this guy stinks! Oh, let me go. I think I see some creativity. Oh! oh what you get? What's going on here? We're making our sauce. Oh shit. That's yeah. nice. We create now our own sauce over there. Oh, we want sauce. Ooh, adding a sauce I hate. Love it. Okay. How do you like barbecue sauce, man? Oh wait, what kind of barbecue sauce? Oh, sweet baby Ray's. Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah. Now, talk to me. So, what's your idea here what, with that? What, with the you, sauce? What you worry? What you worry? I, I just want to know, just so because it could sell you here. I'm very particular with my barbecue sauce. As long as you like what's coming out of here, man. Could you? Could you give us a second, please? Could you? I know you like this. Don't worry about it, man. How many minutes you got left, sir? Ten minutes. Oh man, oh, man more than. Oh, we doing good, man. Mm. You know what's going on in here, man? You know what's going on in here? You know what's going on in here, man? Go and dab it in there, man. Go and dab it in there, man. Hey! 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 You know, before you add over, I want to make sure everything we got in there already covered in sauce, man. Everybody, I want everybody I want them to take. I, want them I got it. I got oh. it. I got it. I added a come nice on. little point there. Right. Come on. Come on. Fellas, I'm not gonna lie. You gotta use the microwave more if you want to see it. Shut up! Get the hell away from here! You got this! They're not using the microwave enough, I'm gonna be honest. All right, after that lap, I am very thrilled at what's to come. The creativity from the brothers, <laughs> I must say, is out of this world. But the microwave use from the brothers is also out of this world. So this is a tough, close matchup right now. Contestants, seven minutes! There's still nothing in there. I just. <laughs> you do shut up, bro. I don't know. Oh, man. So, drop it in here like that. All right? And boom. Explain to the camera what you just did right there, man. It went over the heads, man. You basically took the Twinkie, chocolate stick, put it in the back. That is also something that's trending right now on TikTok. If y'all catch what we just did right there. Put it in the air fryer. It's going to come out with a nice crunch. After that, we're going to split some marshmallows, melt it on top in the mic. <sighs> I don't see how we lose here, man. It's not premature. We added extra time because of the stoppage from earlier. There you go. 
And also it says to take it out and mix it before you put it back in. You want to verify the instructions? Right? I would like to verify. So you're on the stir option? Yeah. All right, that was close. Hey, what cheese it? Oh, okay. How much time we got left, sir? You have four minutes. Nobody does this, man! Damn! They don't understand that, man! Frozen burritos. Frozen pizzas. Talk to me, man. Is that another mouth? Macaroni. Is that another point? <laughs> Ramen noodles. Yes, another point. Leftovers. Come on, man. Hot Back down the fries. Hot pockets. <laughs> Come on, man. Let's stop doing this, man. This thing carried us, man. I don't know the new day and age. You know, y'all probably eating out the. I'm talking like an old head. You know, the, the, the air fry yeah, thing. Man. But this thing right here, man. I'm telling you, bro. What is your use of Pop Tart? Dessert. Is, man. Dessert. Giving you some savory. You know, something a little sweet to wash down the palate. You know, the, the, the air fry. Follow me. I don't like my Pop Tarts heated. And in the microwave? Go look in there. Go look in there. Oh my goodness. Go look in there. Did you look at this? Somebody come look oh, at this. Oh my god. I know what I'm doing. Is that what I think it is? Yes. Yes. I fucking hate the air fryer. What? Wow. Disgusting. I think it's gonna match when, when he tastes it. When he tastes it. No, no, no. Let him go. Disgusting. I'm pissed off now. Microwave challenge, air fryer. God damn it. Where is it? What is he talking about, man? We using multiple. Come on, man. Just a little bit of that barbecue no, flavor. You think a little more than that? Oh, I think it's perfect. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Worry about your own that team, Twinkie please. Is he got legs? That thing got legs, bro. Ladies what? and gentlemen, this is such a close game. I don't even know, like. You're making it close. Don't don't stop the cap of the video. Bro, bro, we already at the finish line, man. Contestants, one minute and 30 seconds. Perfect. That's what we're looking for. They need to be plated when the time is up. Man, how do you look at Chris. What food is it? We're softening the ice cream for you. Mitchell and James are crushing it with the microwave use. How much time we got left? 54 seconds. Oh, shit. Go, go, go. Was that premature? Wait, I forgot to do it. More mic. Wait to use the last couple of seconds. Due to the premature pullout, I am not awarding a point. But wait, no, wait, we purposely but said there was time. You added something time. else, so we had to maneuver. Fine. What, what the fuck? Whoa! Oh my goodness! What? All right, I'm done grading, fellas. Ten, nine. Matt, where's the time? Eight, there? Seven, six, five, four, three, two, Chris, one. Waiting. Plates. Hands up. The competition is over. Look, I know Mitchell and I look like we haven't slept in two days, but I'm proud of what we put together. First up, Mal and Cash. Yo. Tell me about your dish. I had to move this shit right here out the way. All right. All right. So, Chris, let me move over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'd like to talk to him on both sides, you know? Oh, right. okay. Yeah, yeah. Make him feel oh, so, so, oh, so, so, oh. Chris, so what's going on right here, we have the, the Riz dish, you know what I mean? The Riz dish? Yeah, the Riz dish. Oh, R -I -Z -Z, okay. R-I-Z-Z, right? Okay. So what we did, we got the tortillas, right? We put them on, uh, on some of the butter is delicious. Just know that, all right? We put it in there, we fry it a little bit, we infuse with the butter, literally infuse. Yes. And then what we did is, we put the microwave rice inside the microwave, and he put water in there so it make it fluffy. Right. You know, with the rice. So we incorporate the rice with the microwave with that. So then what we did is we had the microwave chicken nuggets sauteed in the sauce specially handmade by Cash himself. And that was barbecue 100% sauce, honey with barbecue sauce. sauce. And he, sure, he made sure he cut every slice of the chicken nugget in. For every bite that you take, it won't be too much nugget. And Carefully then, thought of for you, Chris. Yes, and then what we did is, because we know you got a long esophagus. Yes. Uh, so, what we, so what we did was we actually put them together and then we put cheese on it as well and put it inside the microwave so it's infused with the microwave cheese, mozzarella cheese. Now let's step over here, right? Like that was just the entree. Now it is, the, okay, talk right. to me about the dessert. So this right here, what Malcolm made right here, so this right here from an episode of Bust and Disgusting that would be uploaded. Shout out. Uh, what it do is you have the Twinkie and what you do is you put oh, chocolate. Oh, it's a Twinkie? Yes. Twinkie? Mm. That looks delicious. Yes. So I'm not going to lie. Air fryer, right? But the air fryer does the crunch. You get the crunch. Yes. Right. right. I'm not a fan of the air fryer. I got to admit, boys. I, I'm, I'm sorry. But 
Hey, creativity, man. It doesn't matter when it comes to taste. Yes. Okay, so. so put a marshmallow and two caramels on top of that. And it's like, well, it's gonna be more taste than look. And here we are. It's time to taste. Do you guys mind going on this yeah. side? Oh, I don't want. I don't want any spoilers. I definitely was just about to take a peek. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with the bigger cheese side here. This is white rice? Microwave. White rice. Microwave. Jasmine. White rice, right? Yeah. With soy sauce. I'm tasting a lot right now. I know. But that's not always a good thing. Okay. okay. On to the dessert. I think I should probably bite it from the middle. Surprisingly <laughs> so. It's something with the air fryer does. It's something that crunches it. It looks like a twinkie in the morning. It's that. crazy. We might be on to something there. That's all I'm saying. Can I have a napkin, please? Is there a napkin? Will it give us an extra point? <laughs> wow, what the fuck? Um, let me score this really quick. All right, team two, Moochie and James. What's up, Chris? Tell me about your dish. So Mitchell and I, our number one goal was to really represent microwave games. Yes, we I saw that. We wanted everything to be microwaved. We didn't want to use some jank ass stove or mm. an air fryer. Or so some this is oil. straight microwave. Everything, everything is microwave. Everything you put in your mouth will have been inside of a microwave as well. So walk me through the sandwich. It's a chicken sandwich with taquito. Mac Tequila? And cheese, taquito. Oh. Mac and cheese and a little hit of barbecue. Mm. You niggas love barbecue. I see what you did with the cheese. Now, I found that very creative. Wait a minute. You lied to me. How did I lie to you? I saw how you buttered your buns. But they also did make an appearance. What? <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> you saw them yesterday. They're pretty pale. There's no butter on those things. No, I'm talking about how you buttered them. <laughs> You're not slick. But we did use the microwave as much as we possibly could. Explain to me how you cooked the chicken. Microwave. Microwave. But like, did you follow the instructions? It said four minutes on high. That's what we did. Mm. Okay. I feel like your use of the barbecue sauce, you could have found a better sauce to complement the cheese, to go with that chicken. I think the cheese honestly probably sold it in the sense of just like- Overpower. Yeah, just, it's a weird taste right now. Let me try from the middle though, because you know, the taquito didn't really reach the end that well. Oh. Actually, I'm good. <laughs> my, fault. my fault, my fault. All right, so talk to me about your dessert dish. Pop-tart ice cream sandwich with a uh, little stick. Two sticks, in fact. In case you oh. want to use them as like chopsticks. Is this ice cream? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. What flavor is a Pop-tart? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> s'mores. Oh, s'mores, bro. S'mores. 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 It's like a campfire. Pretend someone just told you a scary story. Take another bite, maybe. I'm not trying to be funny here. But, like, what the fuck? Like, it's so good. Yeah, I know, right? Unfortunately, it's not a good what the fuck. All what the fucks are good. If you guys want to just take a step outside, I'll call you in when I'm ready with the scores. Maybe I'll buy a piece of it. Oh yeah, go yeah, ahead. Please. You can, um, you know, you deserve it. It's fine. We'll clean it. This is all the your fault. These so cooking this videos is all your are very, fault. very, very tough. We, we use the we microwave use, like, a lot. Double the amount. Triple. Yeah. We could have made something that tasted good if we weren't using the flavor destroyer, which yeah. is known as the microwave. Yeah. My but, personal belief that yeah. the microwave is awful for making food with, and probably really unhealthy to consume anything that has come out of it. Something you beer, my man. <laughs> it actually got it off. I know. That paid man. <laughs> when it comes off the stove, crunch. it's like Jake Paul. When it comes off the microwave, it comes off like who's the dude a Jake Paul beat? Ben Askren. The other dude. Nate Robinson. The other dude. Uh, Deji. The other dude. Why did you name everybody but the one? <laughs> oh, Tyrone oh, Woodley. Tyrone Woodley. Yeah, when it comes out of the microwave, it's like a Tyrone Woodley. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It just kind of falls. Racism. What's racist? Off the stove, it's white. Out of the microwave, it's a black guy. 
<laughs> Usually things that come off the stove are pretty dark. Yeah, but you're saying whatever comes off the stove is better. It's not come out of the microwave, it's worse. Well, Jake Paul won the fight. If, if Tyson actually won the fight, then Jake Paul would have been the microwave. He didn't even fight Tyson. His name's Tyrone. <laughs> <laughs> bro, Chris trying to troll any type of way, bro. I swear, bro. I'm not doing no more videos, bro. Contestants, we are ready. Contestants, I must say, both squads. Creativity, it was there. Some teams had more than the other. The use of the microwave, I have to say, Mitchell and James, supreme. Damn near a perfect score. Cash and Malcolm, creativity, damn near a perfect score. Now the taste. Start off with Cash and Malcolm. You know, I love the little uh, chicken nugget burrito that you guys made from scratch. So applaud to you. The taste, again, I'm not a fan of the barbecue sauce, but when it's Sweet Baby Ray's, I make an exception. And no, this isn't sponsored. You had a sponsorship with them though, right? No. That's where we okay. come. I never had a sponsorship with them yet. <laughs> Call me. I felt like there was too much How going. How keep going over <laughs> <laughs> to the left side. <laughs> <laughs> the keeps going on this side for some reason. Was <laughs> there was a lot of flavorness going on. It wasn't bad flavors, but for me, it was just too much going on in my mouth and it made me uncomfortable. But when we go to the dessert, <laughs> I was so comfortable that I didn't give a fuck that I was uncomfortable before that. Okay, cool. Amazing. That's probably out of all cook-offs, I'm not even trying to exaggerate here. That is the best dessert I've tasted and seen. Um, Mitchell, James, this, Yeah. I thought I could think of something positive through this whole time. I, I just can't, I don't like to, you know, nag on dishes, but the crunch from the chicken, I understand, you know, maybe it could have been cooked better without a microwave, but you guys utilize the fuck out of the microwave. And unfortunately the chicken just didn't cut it for me. The cheese, I saw what you're going there with the mac and cheese. But I wish you didn't add the barbecue sauce on top of that kind of cheese. That's where you kind of messed up. And then the dessert. First of all, never put a fucking pop tart in a microwave ever again. That is that's my fault. That's not microwave gang etiquette at all. The thought was there, which I did award you for, but the execution and taste was awful. The ice cream, what fucking flavor was that? I also I don't know. I wish I knew, so when I go to an ice cream shop, I will never get that. Chris, the flavor was... Is it Napoleon shit or something? Peanut butter hail? No, we thought, Chris, what? because you guys what? supplied all the ingredients today, that you actually would enjoy that flavor. I buy ingredients what you think I like. I like to test you a little bit, and you failed that part. So, I had to grade you a two for taste. Malcolm and Cash, a five. Now, the microwave. I scored you guys, Malcolm and Cash, a six. Mitchell and James, a nine. Now it comes down to this, the taste. Mitchell and James. Wait, what was the first category? The taste. I mean the creativity, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the burrito hitting. I'm waiting, I'm waiting to tell them. <laughs> the, the, the final category, creativity. We're all creative in your own ways. Well, thank you. Some of your own ways didn't cut it. Mitchell and James, scored a two. Out of 10? There's a lot of deductions. It's like a B minus. You were at a four. Cash and Malcolm, who are also the champions, scored a nine. Congratulations. <laughs> ah! I wouldn't give you a 10, but you used an air fryer. So I had, I but had to But the air fryer is a reason why that it, Twinkie tastes so well, good. Well, that helped you with the taste. It was you, good. I want you guys to taste you this. Really, I don't uh, want to uh, eat soy sauce with cheese. Congratulations, you two. Here is your prize. You just saw the Look at this microwave. Golden microwave. Microwave champion. Chris, he literally got a spray paint can and just painted the motherfucker. No, this is pure 10 karat gold. Well, I'll take it. Well, anyways, <laughs> make sure you guys subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed that series Chris, and that, oh, that is going to do it. Do you, do you know how you, you forgot how the taste of creativity? Yes. Because we put infused. Uh, you want to tell them? Oh, you guys fucking drugged me? I'm, and that'll wrap up this <laughs> 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 Yo, what's up? It's Chris London. Just want to give a shout out to GWB and Doritos. Here's an exclusive clip of me on their show, Launching Point. Check it out. Something that I 
would probably take an I should listen to myself is just um, act now rather than, you know, saying, oh, I'm going to start you know, next week or things like that. Because I think that's a, a something I struggle with is like I'll have like a plan and I'll be like, all right, I'm going to start on Monday or I'll start on the first of the month. No, just like literally go do it. Something right now.